It doesn't get any more tension packed than this. The 2022 FIFA World Cup final. Who is going to come out on top? We'll have all the action for you next on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city center, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Brazil versus Mexico. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. The starting 11 for Brazil. Alisson begins in goal. Marquinhos plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. Casemiro plays alongside Lucas Paqueta in central midfield. And the striker is Richarlison. Here's how Mexico will begin the game. Well, they're also playing in a 4-3-3 formation, but they play it in a slightly different way, particularly in the wide areas, where their fullbacks will get forward and rotate with the wingers at every opportunity. And so the battle commences. Casemiro Thiago Silva Now Casemiro Richarlison uh, Mexico recovering possession well Richarlison Here's Casemiro well, that's how to beat your opponent. Can he finish this? Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. Short corner favoured. Giving it a try. Body in the way. Not a chance for them again to play it over from the corner flag. Elects to go short. Silva. Now just the tackle that was needed. Well, it's a good idea not to pay too much attention to how a team qualifies for the World Cup. Mexico had their struggles, but in the tournament itself, they've been nothing short of magnificent. Remember, no team from CONCACAF has ever won the World Cup, but Mexico might be the first. Well, I have to say, I'm so pleased for Mexico. They're such a big footballing nation. And at last, they have a team that's got a chance of winning the World Cup. If they win here tonight, it will be great for football. It will be great for Mexico. Will they do it? I'm not quite sure. Oh, hang on, Stuart. Look at this. The opening goal in the final. And how important could that be as a direction pointer?
Well, let's see this again. He tries to run out with the ball. He has the ball taken off of him. He's made the wrong decision. And suddenly the ball's in the back of the net. Terrible defending. And so Brazil get the game restarted. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they come up with a quick response? Richarlison is with Vinicius Junior. And Neymar! Can they square the game? Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. Richarlison being egged on by the crowd. Neymar, well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. Lozano, nicely timed tackle. Casemiro, Neymar. Richarlison and Neymar Neymar a smart stop here <laughs> Jesus Gallardo Casemiro and Neymar! And still looking to get the shot off. Oh, a goal! He's equalised! Was he made from moments like this? On an occasion like this? Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And then from that sort of range, Neymar was never going to miss. It's a well-worked goal. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Now a decent position, Richarlison, oh there it is, there's the goal that gives them the lead, just what they wanted. Well as the replay shows us, Vinicius Junior's pass is inch perfect and then the shot could not be hit any better, struck with such venom, great goal. So there we have it, 2-1. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. It might be! And the keeper more than equal to it. An example of a goalkeeper in top form here. Wonderfully weighted pass. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Could be a chance to break here. And let's give credit to the defending. Neymar. Oh, the threat is there. Well, the supporters think it's on. And a goal to increase the lead in this final. Will they be stopped now? Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, but he's still got so much work to do. 
just look at the strength he shows to hold off the defender and still get his shot away. That's a really good finish. So back underway at 3 1. And space for them here on the flank. Well, it didn't go to plan in the end. And they'll be a bit annoyed to have lost the ball. This looks promising out wide. No way through. Vinicius Junior, tremendously strong in the tackle. Now can they counter clinically? Oh, what an opportunity! And it goes to reduce the deficit. Still very much alive and kicking. Well, here it is again, and the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against, but there's still plenty to do from here. He hits it so well, though. Lots of pace, lots of power, and the keeper just can't react in time. It's a great strike. Well, back underway, and a glut of goals here. 3-2. Vinicius Junior. Ball with Danilo. And Neymar! And he read it well, intercepting it. Henry Martin. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Might really be able to trouble them here. Surely, there it is, two to the good now, and that gives them a buffer. Well, I have to say, he's done really well here. He's in the right place, and then a decent finish. That's a good goal. And the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Brazil now in a potentially dangerous position. Teammates available, but quick thinking defensively. This might be ideal for the counter. All hands on deck. Just cutting off the supply. Lozano. Wonderful chance! And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Substitution time it is here. Playing it short. Lost into the penalty area. 
Well, the attack will peter out. Keeper's ball. Neymar. Oh, a lovely ball. Michalisson. Really vital interception. Richarlison and the counter looks on here options available defenders need to cover well it came to nothing in the end well there it is Brazil have controlled the possession and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly their pressing has been excellent and they just haven't stopped working it's been a fantastic oh, opportunity here Stuart and he clears it out of harm's way So a half an hour remaining. Interception to snuff out the danger. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. Oh, a nearly moment, but not quite good enough. Well, you certainly can't fault them for effort. They keep applying the pressure, and if they can just nick one, they're right back in this. They decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Thiago Silva. Vinicius Junior. On to Richarlison. And it might be... A goal! How about that? He's put it away to make it a hat-trick. Well, here it is again, and I have to say, the defending is so poor. They make so many bad decisions there. No wonder the keeper's exposed. So the action continues, and it's been a thorough masterclass from Brazil so far. You do sense it's a question of how many. Lozano. Sanchez. And good work to deny the chance. Time for a change then. And deciding to go short with this one. And making the run to the inside. A goal! That's two for him today. They simply can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating. Well, here's another look at it. Certainly delivery into the box couldn't have been any better. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. the scoreline we see all that often 5-3 well we have 20 minutes left in this game Thiago Silva now Casemiro Alexandro Neymar now with Richarlison can he put it in and there it is another goal and surely there's no way back from this now well here's another look and you can see what a good finish this is he holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure that's a great goal
So they restart the game and only one team in it. Oh, good vision. Well, it looked like it might lead to something very positive indeed, but a useful interception. Oh, he's put it just a fraction wide of the post. Rafinha they've regained possession on the ball Chavez can he convert every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one Neymar Unable to get himself back onside here. Well, he was always going to be offside. That was the wrong option. Vega. Chavez Jimenez Casemiro acquitting himself magnificently to win it back now counter attacking possibilities here Jimenez and he's in majestic piece of goalkeeping well he loves the big moments doesn't he and he's proved it again there great goalkeeping He's driven in the corner. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. That's what you call defending from the... Oh, magnificent from the keeper. Fantastic stop. Richarlison. And threading it forward. On full marks for trying, but very deftly cut out. Well, they might be onto something. A goal! An exceptional performance, this. Four to the good now. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, what an extraordinary scoreline. Does this game have more goals in it? The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Jimenez, able to get a body in the way. Richarlison. Well, not hard to read that pass. And the referee brings this final to an end for the first time in 20 years. Brazil are world champions once more. Well, no surprise there, Derek. Brazil have been brilliant and they fully deserve this trophy.
Brazil, the world champions. And this try, if you just feel, Stuart, is going to be fondly remembered by all Brazilians. You're absolutely right. They've played some great football. They've been inspiring. There's been some great individual performances. It's been outstanding from them.